think one of the greatest challenges, right, is having an idea or concept that's really intriguing. You have only that much time to communicate so much. You don't have the five minutes to ten minutes to establish the character, to establish the place. The same things that go into making a short film also go into making uh, a feature film. It's just on a much smaller level. Filmmakers actually have room to be able to experiment and uh, be creative about what they want to shoot. Well, it's true making short films where I learn about directing actors. You know, it's where I learn, you know, about camera movements, where to put the camera. Just the act of thinking of, okay, what would a story about this and set in this universe look and sound like, uh, that can actually inspire a lot of other uh, stories to come from that as well. The biggest challenge is that you have to express all the content in the film. Because every time you meet a film, you will meet different problems. Uh,包括可能演员啊,地点啊,道具啊,之类的。面对了任何的这个困难跟问题的话,就赶快去解决。这个其实是,呃,课上教不到的。老师没有办法跟你讲的。只有在实习的时候,是最好的一个平台。You spend the time and the effort to make these really, really good shots to the best of your ability, and then you can hone your craft, and then ultimately, you know, go for the big one, which is that first feature. It is a very interesting step in a direction that I think makes a lot of sense, a mobile first film festival. Wow, you know, I was just so excited when I heard about Short and Sharp and, you know, Samsung wanting to create this event. I love to discover young gems and talents. This is a very good way to encourage people to actually try. It would be great, you know, if we could find filmmakers who perhaps didn't go to film school. And they know that it's a platform where they can, you know, hop on to show what they've got. The <laughs> As technology advances, you know, filmmaking is going to be more democratic and more affordable. Um, and I think this is where um, Samsung can come into the picture. Samsung is leading the way and it's just wonderful. And, and I hope also that eventually as this thing carries on to grow, I mean, I started off doing short films for the Singapore International Film Festival. And it'd be so nice now that you have this other platform to discover young talent. If everybody puts their effort into helping to push the message out there, uh, we can actually get the word out to the rest of the world about the, the talent that we have here as well. Filming in low light. Some traditional cameras themselves can't accommodate low light filming, but the Samsung phone is, is pretty awesome in low light. Breaking the 4-4 is a very common thing in films or so. So I think this vlogger mode actually does allow you to explore these kind of different um, concepts. If you understand this phone, I think it's very beautiful. There are a few that I've seen that have a little surprise. Everyone has a phone on them now. And it's very convenient to just like take out the phone and capture something. It's not gonna be missed. Like, you, you know, you have to take out the camera, do the setting, and then like check the lights and all that. The Galaxy S21 Ultra 5G really is a superior smartphone for capturing content. And, you know, I think if you've got this little device, you can really go out there and make some incredible shorts. I mean, right now I'm on a, like a friend's binger. You know, I was just blown away by the kingdom. Korean dramas. A lot of movies from the 70s. Cooking videos on YouTube. For a while, I actually really enjoyed Kara's house. Obsession and passion. Passion and creativity. You need to feel passionate about what you're doing. There are many, many stories that has been told many, many times. But how do you stand out? It's how creative you are in your filmmaking. Love hits. Sweat. Energy management. Contentment. Short and sharp. Tell it your way. <laughs>